Alright, um, I've been meaning to talk about this topic, of, um, about, I am IHE, I hate everything, um, I meant to talk about this, but I didn't, cause, I don't know, I was just lazy, but, um, I'm finally talking about it now, I guess, so, um, if you didn't know, or obviously you might have known, because this stuff went all over the internet, and yeah it just happened i guess so um a youtuber name i hate everything actually got terminated um off of youtube for like no reason he got no reason there's no reason he still doesn't even know why that he got you know um taken off of youtube luckily now he's um he's up again um he's now here uh, so that's good but um when i heard about this i heard about this by my best friend the glamour um and like he said your channel's been terminated why on like twitter first of first at first i didn't believe it but then when i actually went to check on youtube there was an error where i couldn't go look at his videos and i was like oh my god and like he, um, in the, like, the, his second channel, Jar Media, made an exclamation video where he basically said how his channel got deleted, the two reasons why, but he doesn't know exactly why they even did it in the first place. Probably because apparently he broke the YouTube guidelines by posting Destroying the Little Panda Fighter, and it's, um, that's just, it had nothing offensive, nothing... Like, and like it said that he was posting a lot of unwanted and s um, content and spam, which no, he does not. Obviously, he's like, what? Well, he's like my favorite YouTuber. Why, if like, why would he ever post spam and like unwanted content on YouTube? He's, you're, YouTube, it's like he's your con he's a content creator on your um, website. And you take him down for no reason because of your bullcrap community guidelines. Honestly, just sickens me. Actually, this ha this happened to me where I got a strike because of a title of a video when I, back in 2014, I made this video called FIFA 14 Rape. Basically, it was a soccer, it was like a kind of weird thing where a soccer player kept moving back and like side to side on another ba um, soccer player and like I voiced over it the video's gone now because I deleted it and the strike still remained and I didn't know how to handle it I didn't know how to get it out I didn't know how to do anything about it so that strike remained on my channel for like six months I think it was the exact date the exact time the strike was still there and I didn't know how to get it out and like I was a smaller, ch I was a small channel at that time, and I didn't have a word. I didn't, I didn't have a voice. I didn't have a voice. I never, I never had the power to actually um, tell them, or to actually like get supportive, get support to help get the strike away. And yes, the strike has expired, but it's still there, and I can get a second strike if I do something wrong. But that shows how stupid it can be, because I, the word, just because the word rape is in the title, it, um, gave me a strike, which it had no, it was fair use, no copyrighted stuff, it was just me recording a soccer player just going side to side on someone else for, like, a weird glitch, I think, and I voiced over it. There's nothing copyrighted, and, like, yes, he was... Uh, it was just stupid. That showed me how flawed this, this, no, I don't, that showed me how bad this, um, YouTube system is. First, this happens to me, I don't, I have nothing, I can't fight it, because of how small I was. And that strike still remained on my channel, which was just bullcrap. And, yeah, I didn't have anything, I didn't do, I couldn't do anything. I was basically helpless. And now when IHE 
released the news when his channel got terminated. Well, a bunch of people said this. Um, they started this hashtag, hashtag called Free IHE, and I joined in too, just to show my support. And um, I said how this happened to me before. I got a strike, but there was nothing wrong with the video. It just had the word rape in the title, and that showed how stupid it is and how YouTube should step up their crap. And yeah, it was basically just really a dumb event that just happened. What I think about it is just honestly, YouTube needs to, you know, they need to actually take um, notice of the, these problems. This happened to a lot of smaller channels back then, and they had no voice. They had, they never could have fixed it. They couldn't do anything about it. So some channels got taken down, and no one even knew about it. That's what I'm. That's what basically I. I'm since I'm a smaller channel. I'm like below 200 subs. I'm like 185, I think, and I'm still a small channel. No one can ever. If like no one can ever say anything about it. I don't even have a voice. Like no one. I might even. I might ask friends if they can do anything about it, but no. Nah. It's just, it's useless for me. Like, I don't even think I will succeed. I'm probably still gonna try to work on that f strike and get it out of my channel so I can be a clean one. But yeah, I'm stuck with that for now. But like, that shows how awful the YouTube community guidelines is because anything like it just does something it gives you a strike for no reason like for example what happened to me and then out of nowhere i i hate everything gets deleted off of youtube which he did nothing wrong honestly he never did anything wrong they said that he um post the strong little panafighter it was offensive and really like it, it broke the rules which Nothing. There are no rules broken in that video. Uh, there's like nothing. Nothing happened. Nothing that broke the rules. Just an ordinary video of him destroying like five copies of a movie. That's all. That just shows how really just stupid this whole system is. There's, like I said, a lot of smaller channels don't have a voice whenever this stuff happens to them. And, like, I'm afraid that will happen to me again. I can't, like, if I get a second strike, then I don't have any voice to even fight for it. I'm like, there's no there's no chance of winning. You're a small channel, and you get a strike. There's no chance at all. Maybe you can get your audience to do it, or how little of an audience you have. But, yeah, I don't think there's, like, any chance I'm doing it. But yeah, that's all I have to say about this whole thing. I meant to do this like after this whole problem got resolved and he's back. Still, he's back. No, he's back now, yeah. Um, I just wanted to give my opinion on this. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this little video and I, I'm going in a weird direction with my channel because I make like topic videos now like this. Um, just giving my opinion on what I think about this whole fiasco. But, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.